KSI vs Logan Paul Part 2? Pressure building on for Mourinho this weekend. Southgate names his England squad. And energy drinks to be banned for children under 18. This is Defego2 and welcome to the YouTube News. Now we start with what was one of the most controversial uh, moments from this past weekend. The KSI and Logan Paul fight ended in a draw, but there is a rematch on the way. Now there have been rumours that the match might happen in February of next year, but we do not know the date yet. KSI has been itching for another fight and so has Logan Paul, but fans are wanting their refund from the last match. If there were to be a next match though, this match would obviously have a clear winner. So if the match is in February, then I guess I shall go with KSI. For the win. Our next story comes to happen uh, from Old Trafford and there's pressure for Jose Mourinho this weekend. If he loses against Burnley, he is fired as Manchester United manager. And Manchester United have not had a good season at all uh, yet. Even though they did win at Leicester, they've lost 3-2 to Brighton and 3-0 to Tottenham. If this losing streak keeps happening against uh, Burnley, then Jose Mourinho is showing the door. There have been rumours of who is going to replace Mourinho at Manchester United with managers coming as Antonio Conte and Zinedine Zidane. But unfortunately, Zinedine Zidane is the favourite to become Manchester United manager. So we shall see what this has for Manchester United if they lose against Burnley. Our third story is Gareth Southgate has named his 23-man England squad for the international friendlies. Now that before uh, Southgate named his England uh, squad, Leicester City striker Jamie Vardy and Chelsea defender Gary Cahill both withdrew from the England squad and Vardy retiring from international football to give youngsters a go such as Trent Alexander-Arnold, Phil Foden and uh, others. Of course, uh, Jamie Vardy and Gary Cahill were not uh, selected and were not named in the England squad. There have been a couple of names uh, to replace them such as Danny Welbeck and Luke Shaw. So could this be a good start for Gareth Southgate in England this year or this season? We shall find out. And our final story today is energy drinks to be banned for children under 18. Companies such as LucasAid, Red Bull and Monster have all been named for drinks to be banned for children under 18 as an increase of heart rate. There have also been uh, chances for, uh, for children to have obesity in energy drinks. Now I see this as kind of like a good thing because children technically should not have energy drinks until they're 18 because it could uh, increase their heart rate and it could have obesity on them. So for me, I think this is a good idea. So, and that's it for the YouTube news. I hope you guys enjoyed the, this first episode. I will be back uh, next week to give you another YouTube uh, news update. But if you guys want me to keep on doing this, then please let me know in the comments below. And if you guys are new to the channel, then please subscribe so that you never miss any content from the Diva Go To channel. But again, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.